Hey everyone, Wolver Monkey here. Uh, long overdue battle rep. Um, me and Phil are here, and we're going to be playing Warlord again. Um, small game this time, only 600 points. So we'll start things off with uh, an introduction of the armies, then uh, I'll show you the battlefield, give you the slight reason why we're fighting. I mean, we like to have a little scenario a little bit. So, start off with. I'm here uh, to kill sheep. Yeah, if I was going to kill sheep. Yeah, that's my goal. Yeah, death of the sheep. <laughs> the evil empire of the sheep. So, okay, why don't we start us off? Who we so, got? I have uh, our niece, Death Seeker, leading four Death Seekers, obviously. <laughs> and uh, over here we have Varashia, uh, leading four Veil Warriors and two Veil Archers. Um, and then over here we have Selwyn, leading the same. The Veil vale Warriors and Veil vale Archers. And then you got... And the Silvermane Unicorn. For, which is a monster. Monster, yeah. So that's his 600 point... Very simple. ...army list. Now I'll walk you across the battlefield. The, uh, let's see if I get my zooming right. Yeah, I did it right. Okay, as you can see, that's our battlefield for the day. It's, uh, part of a small farming village. or part of a small village. The uh, basic gist of why we're fighting, because we like having a reason, not just to kill the other guy. Um, the undead are on a recruiting drive. So they stopped at this village to recruit some new troops. And the elves decided that uh, they're going to put a stop to that. So they showed up to try and stop the undead from making more. So for my 600 points, we have... Um, let's see. Hey, there we go. Alright, I got, um, Elzebrith Briarkiss as the leader, uh, Vanderast and Naomi, Queen of Bats, two skeleton archers, and four swordsmen. The next unit has, uh, Grave Rot as a leader. He also has two archers. Three skeleton swordsmen and one burrowing zombie. And then the rest of the points are a unit of five burrowing zombies. So that's it for 600 points. Um, it was really tough trying to figure out what we were going to use for 600 points because we used to, you know, as you guys seen the other videos, we played eight, then we played a thousand, then we played 1200. <laughs> So we're like, okay, let's try a 600 point game so it's a little quicker. So it was, it was really hard trying to fit stuff into 600 points and have something worth anything. So we're going to give it a go and uh, I'm going to do a deployment and uh, let you guys see the deployment and then we'll go into the first turn. So see you at the end of deployment. Okay guys, we did the uh, deployment by card. We went six inches in. So I'm on this side. So there's Grave Rot's group. The die represents the burrowed zombies. And there's my other group behind the house in the hills. And then Phil's guys, uh, those guys have Ranger, so they already did their advance. And you kind of put everybody else in one cluster. Oh, and if you're wondering, those are the sheep he mentioned earlier. So that's our deployment, and now we're going to get into playing turn one. So I'll see you at the end of turn one. Okay guys, end of turn one, and uh, not much went on really, we moved. Uh, let's see, I got first draw on the cards, so the dice represents the burrowing zombies, so I had them run up the road. Uh, Phil got the next three. Yeah, so I basically moved up here to the rough terrain, mm -hmm. uh, moved some archers up on the ridge, and then the next one was uh, to run the uh, Death, Death Seekers. Seekers. Yeah. Where yeah. that rough patch is. And your pony teleported behind the trees. Yeah, the pony ran over there. And then it was my Yours, next yeah. two. So I moved Grave Rot's group up. And I moved these guys up and totally forgot that I was going to attack you. Because we were bullshitting too much. <laughs> you missed the attack. Yeah, we were totally bullshitting a lot. All I did was move and I'm like, yeah, it's your turn. Maybe dude. we'll go back to that. So, and then, uh, yeah, I just moved over to the side there. He's protecting the sheep. Yeah, I'm actually uh, using them as cover. Yeah. 
<laughs> They're not bad. But, uh, okay, guys, that we'll see bad. you. Yeah, that was bad. <laughs> we'll see you at the end of turn two. And hopefully I'll remember to attack somebody next time. Okay, guys, end of turn two. Um, I pulled the first card again. So basically the burrowing zombies went from here and they ran over there. So that's where they're at. Then Phil had the all the next activations. Yeah, basically uh, I went with Selwyn first. So they fired in and uh, yeah, so these three here killed these two and Selwyn wounded uh, Elizabeth. No, that's... Um, oh, uh, yeah, that's her. Naomi. Naomi. Yeah, Naomi, Mistress of Bats. Um, she took a hit. Yeah, and then you went with those archers. I went with these archers here, fired across, and uh, killed two of the, Skeleton. the skeletons. An archer and a swordsman. Yeah, and the swordsman kind of moved over here to help these. Um, and then the unicorn kind of just hid out. He's moving closer. Yeah, he went from that tree over here to this tree. And then the. Uh, Death Seekers moved up to get into range, you know, to uh, attack eventually. True that. Didn't make it quite there, so. Very close, though. Yeah, they were caught caught out in the open, so. And it then. It wasn't uh, perfect. Well, you went as far as you can go, though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you heard that one guy was only like an inch away, too. Yeah. So that kind of sucked So nuts. close. And yet so far. <laughs> then the last two, of course, were mine. And uh, let's see. I had the brewing zombie here go under, so he moved his whole two inches, because you only go half speed on your first uh, time you went under. Everybody else moved over here. This archer took a shot at uh, that death seeker and missed miserably. Then these guys went. Uh, let's see. Naomi moved here and cast a firestorm to him. Hit him, hit that one, but missed her. So they both took a point and they're burning. Then the melee occurred. Uh, three of the skeletons were on this guy. And let's see. They killed him, but he managed to take out two of them with him. Yeah, he frenzied. Yeah, he frenzied. And got two hits. So. And this guy managed to get his cleave in. And this guy did one point. This guy did missed. Then the two vampires... Um, Elizabeth and Vanderas tag team this guy, and Elizabeth put him down, and then he missed on his returns. That's actually a she, isn't it? Yeah, it's got boobies. It's yeah. a she. <laughs> the elves are hard to Eureka. sell. They're like, you can't tell us half the time it's a guy or a girl. But anyway. They're pretty. Yeah, they're pretty. So she went down, and neither one of those guys got hit. So that's where we're at at the end of turn two. Oh, yeah, the archer guy here. Managed to put a point on this guy. That's why he's got the skull there. I forgot about that. Yeah, shot over. Yeah. Yeah, he shot over the heads of everybody since he's on a hill. So I lost the two death seekers. And yeah. Yeah, you lost two death seekers, and I'm down two, four, six guys already. So I'll clear the dead off the board. I just left them there right now. Actually, speaking of dead, I gotta roll to see if I get zombies. Oh, do you have that doctrine? Graveyard doctrine. Yeah, yeah I always that. use that. Yeah. So I gotta. See if I get zombies out of those two guys. Uh, I only get a 10% chance. I have to roll a 10 on a 10 cider, but sometimes it happens. I get lucky. So we'll see you guys at the end of turn three. Bye. Huh? What? That was the end of three? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, guys, that's the end of turn three. Uh, let's see. I pulled first, so I activated this unit. And this was a really busy turn. Uh, let's see, she moved up here. Uh, this guy sh shucked an arrow at a Death Seeker over here and killed him? Uh, I missed. No? He missed, okay. Yeah. She cast another Firestorm over here at a guy that was here. She had five targets and she lit up every one of them. Then in melee, uh, Elizabeth and Van der Rass attacked Arnice. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Neither of the vampires took a hit? Uh, no, not from her. And then she went down. This skeleton attacked a Death Seeker and he lost. He died. And that was the it for those guys. 
Then Phil went next with your archer guys over there. Yeah, I went I went with the main unit and uh yeah, Selwyn and the two archers Yeah. Had fired in. They put another arrow another arrow in a her, in Naomi. Yeah. And that was it for those guys? That's the only person they shot? Yeah, I believe so. Okay. Yeah, I think I yeah, I took a couple shots at the vampires and missed them. That's right. Yeah. Yeah, you did. As I know you did more than just shoot her. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you, you shot at the other guys and missed. Okay. Yeah, I kind of split them up. And then the warriors kind of just positioned themselves. Yeah, they moved around on the top of the hill. Yeah. To, to get a better spread. And to get firebombed. <laughs> yeah, and to get firebombed, yeah. <laughs> so, so, then it was yours again. And... Um, actually, it was Phil's. Yeah, but, yeah. Um, Naomi's got a spy ability. So we have to put Phil's card to the side and draw the next card and do that. It kind of like makes you hold your activation, one activation. And it worked out. It worked out. I got it. So I activated the zombies. They popped up in the middle over here. And um, the long and the short of it is those two elves died. That zombie died. Um, I did get one zombie. For, sorry. For the graveyard doctrine, I did get one zombie out of his dead guy. He attacked him, and his Veil, veil uh, Warrior smashed my zombie pretty good there. Uh, let's see... That guy was dead from... Firebombing? Yeah. The second yeah. time. He took two firebombs, right? Yeah, yeah. So that's what put him down. And she's got a mark from... The firebomb. From the firebomb, too. Okay. Then it was... It was mine again. Yeah, back to you. And what did you do? Uh, Your veil. The, that was the uh, Death Seeker. The Death Seeker guy. Yeah. He went from over here. Yeah. And did, Swift uh, attacked through the. Yeah, he Swift attacked through, um, uh, her. Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Hit her for one. And he ran over here. Yep. And then uh, I got it again, or no, you got it uh, again? No, I got it again. And yeah. then the. Uh, the unicorn moved from here, over here, and uh, actually managed to kill yeah, he Naomi. Killed Naomi. And then she got one hit on him. Yeah. So, as a defensive strike. And then I got it again, and these three archers uh, uh, shot over here. Yeah, f killed. You know, one in each of these, and then wounded a the grave, grave rot. rot. Yep. And the warriors moved from the middle of the road up to support those. Okay. And then it was yours. The last one I had, um, the burrowing zombies, the one single burrowing zombie, he's over there now, under the river. The skeleton moved up, took a shot at the Death Seeker, Death Seeker killed yeah. him, and Grave Rot just ran over here. And that was it for the end of turn three. Turn three. That was a really busy turn. We had a lot of shit going on. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty brutal, actually. So. A lot of elves died. Actually, yeah, for a change instead of my undead guy. So we're going to clear the corpses off the field before we continue. Uh, we're leaving them laying down for now. That way we, remember, we can remember what the hell we did, who yeah. died, and why. There's a lot of time between turns for us. Yeah. We, Not for we, you. We, we tend to bur bullshit a lot. So <laughs> what you see takes five minutes, took us like half an hour because we bullshit a lot about other stuff. Or, or longer. Yeah, or longer sometimes, depending. <laughs> but that's part of the fun, right? So... Yeah. Okay, see you at the end of turn four. Okay, guys, end of turn four, and uh, much chaos ensued. You went first? Yeah, I went with what the you uh, did? unicorn. Okay, what so did you unicorn do? So the unicorn popped away from here and uh, moved up to attack one of the... Uh, zombies. Grave zombies. The burrowing zombies. Burrowing zombie. Yeah. And uh, killed it, but... It made it tough roll. Yeah. I love that tough roll. Yeah. It's a big fan of Phil. <laughs> that and vampires. Yeah. <laughs> and Burrow. And also. Burrowing. Which those guys do, by the way. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. He, he went after the him, killed him, but he made his tough roll. A lot of stuff I love. So, then what? Then it was uh, my turn? <laughs> yeah, it was your turn. And I don't really remember what I did. So... Uh, it was the... The zombies Burrowing went. zombies. Yeah, the zombies went... Oh, man, I don't really remember what the hell we did. Well, um, I know you killed the one... Three guys. One, yeah, one of the 
he moved after the unicorn. Yeah, two of them did. Um, him and him, they managed to put one wound on the unicorn. Uh, this guy failed his attack because he's dead. Uh, let's see. That, sorry. That guy died. This zombie fought some guys. He survived one of his tough rolls to kill him, but then he finally put him down. Uh, I forgot how he died fighting a zombie too, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah, that... So, and this guy, he's made his tough roll like, what, three times already? Three times. Yeah, yeah three times three he's times. made his tough roll. He's supposed to be dead three times now. Three times. And, um, let's see. <laughs> Those guys ran around the corner trying to get over to the fun. Yeah, my, uh, my archers here pulled away from the, the sheep, unfortunately. Yeah. I had to surrender the sheep because of that burrowing. <laughs> yeah, my, the one burrowing guy that was over here yeah. and then the river. Now he, he went after those guys and they hauled ass over there. And they scare me, so I ran right. away. Even though it's one burrowing zombie. Yeah, oh well, yeah, yeah, well, I ran. Yeah, he ran. <laughs> so that's... So then, uh, yeah. Yeah. And then I kind of came back in and, yeah, melee. Yeah, he fought the other zombies and... So basically I lost... One, three two, guys? three. Yeah, three guys, and I lost uh, one zombie, and the other zombie was actually your guy to begin with, anyway. Yeah, yeah. He, so he came back. Thanks. And even those guys have a tough three roll, so it's kind of yeah, silly. Which I'm like, okay, so he he steals my guy, and then that guy gets tough. That's, yeah. That sucks. And he killed what two of your guys? Two of my guys. Yeah. So, yay, it's fun to be undead. <laughs> it is not fun. Okay, guys, we'll see you at the end of turn five, which will probably be it, don't you think? Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Okay. The, yeah, this will, it's not going to be all dead, but it'll determine who. There'll be enough dead things that we're not going to continue, yeah. probably. So, I mean, it's going to be one major cluster frack right there, and that'll be it, so. And he's still got, like, scary vampires, so. Yeah, two scary vampires and a ghast. <laughs> And, uh, and, a burrower and still got one burrower left up too. Well, it's underground and one, two, two left up over there too. Yeah. Be beating on your horse. Yep. So okay, guys, see you at the end. Everyone, of end of turn five. Uh, not too much left on the field. Phil got the first three draws. So the first thing he did was pop the unicorn over here and attack my skeleton, but he didn't actually kill him. He survived. Then he had the group with the archers. They ran, they came over here by the by hill. By the hill and shot, yeah. They shot, um, what did they shoot, a zombie? Yeah. They killed him? They killed him, yeah. Yeah, that was the, um, the one guy that was your guy, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah they finally yeah, killed, they, they killed the regular the, zombie. The regular zombie, and then they ran behind the trees. The two fighter guys came over here and fought the green zombie and finally killed him. That's He had... Uh, Took what seven attacks to finally seven, kill that guy. Seven deaths. Yeah. That, that's after he was actually dead. Yep. That's seven after seven he died. After that. that doesn't include the ones it took to actually kill him. <laughs> it's insane. Um, this guy attacked that zombie and put what one wound on him. Yeah. Okay, and that was it for Phil. Then I got the last three, so the vampires ran up this way. Their trusty archer attacked the horse and did nothing, and the horse killed him on the return with the defensive strikes. Yep. Uh, let's see, the one zombie attacked the elf and they killed each other. Then Grave Rot ran up. Uh, the burrowing zombie ran from there to, he's right behind that tree there, you can't see him. See that dice? There he is. And the lone archer moved out so he can get a clear shot at the unicorn and failed. So that's the end of turn five. So, it's so far a good game. Oh yeah. So I'll see you at the end of six. Okay guys, end of turn six. Not much left. Phil got first draw. Yeah, the archers moved here and fired at uh, the, vampires. the vampires and didn't missed everything. Yeah, yeah. All, you missed all of them by one. And then the two L warriors rush attacked, or uh, swift attacked to uh, Elzebeth. Elzebeth and uh, did a wound, actually. Yeah, yeah. yeah they got one wound uh, and then she struck back and killed. Uh, she killed the one laying right there. Yeah, that one. She killed that one. Yep. And then, um... And it was yours. Twice. Yeah, Grave Rot's group went first, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, this guy took a shot at the unicorn while he was still here and missed. Uh, the burrowing zombie went from over there to the edge of the pond. And Grave Rot was there and he bum-rushed, charged that guy. 
and um, killed him. And then the next one was me again. Yeah. And then that was the vampire unit. Who are all I have left are those two vampires. So they went from there and they're going after the archers straight through the pond. And then the last one was Phil. And the unicorn rush attacked and killed the archer there. And that's it for turn six. Yeah. So see you at the end, end of turn seven. Uh, Phil won the draw. <laughs> Run and gun. And the archers moved back and fired at uh, Elizabeth. Elizabeth and killed her. Yep, she had two left out of her four. Yeah, all three fired and got her. And they nailed her. And then uh, that's all you had left for those guys, just the archers. Yeah, yeah. yep. And then it was you with... Uh, it was me with Grave Rot's Grave unit. Rot. Uh, Grave Rot ran from over there to over there. The zombie went from the edge of the pond to the to the first guy. He was able to charge him. Popped up and killed him. Um, then it was Phil again. Yeah, and the unicorn jumped uh, from there to attack Grave Rot. And yep. missed by one. And Grave Rot missed him back by one. By one. <laughs> and then um, that was it for that. Then it was mine again. And yes, all I had yeah. left was Van Der Rass, So I moved from the pond to where he's at right now. Yep. And that's it for seven. So see you at the end okay, of guys, eight. This is the end of turn eight and nine. Because, well, we didn't really have very many guys left. Um, you got it first? Yeah, I got it first. And you blinked over... And I blinked over to uh, attack... Um, the zombie. The zombie. And what happened? Uh, I missed, and you got a defensive hit on me. That's right. Okay, then it was... Then the archers, uh, one pulled back and fired at uh, uh, Grave Rot. Right. And missed. And missed, and one fired at the uh, the zombie. Yeah, the blonde Her fired arm. at the zombie. And yeah. And she missed, too. She missed. So then the zombie attacked... The horse and killed him. And, and I missed my defensive strike. Yeah, the horse. Or no, I did, and you toughed, right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. The horse did hit the zombie, but the zombie made his defensive strike. Oh. And then uh, we went with the next turn. Or yeah, no, uh, yeah that's they, my two guys they, moved up. Two and they charged in, so they, they locked charged. up my guys. Yeah, both uh, Vanderast and Grave Rot charged. They failed because they fell short, so they charged again. Um, yeah, they don't get to attack, but now the archers are stuck in base to and melee combat. So we went with turn nine, and then basically I tried to escape out of melee. Yeah. And failed both discipline checks with my uh, archers. Right. So. So then the uh, zombie and Vanderast finished off the one archer, and Grave Rot finished off the other one. Yep. And I didn't get any more zombies, so all I got left is a vampire, a ghast, and a zombie. So that was it, guys. That was a really fun game. Yeah, that was a long one. Um, yeah, it actually went a lot longer than we thought, being only a 600-point game. And actually, the last four or five turns, they weren't even bullshitting that much. Yeah. But um, it still went a lot longer than we thought it would for only 600 points. So hope you guys enjoy it, and uh, more videos coming soon. Thanks for watching. Thanks.